Stevie's bodyguard Cash Newman was next to face danger when he found Sidney waiting for him at home. With Sidney still armed, Cash was forced to play along with his demands as he sought reassurance over Stevie's fate. As news of the shooting hadn't hit the news due to a media blackout, Sidney feared that he'd failed in his evil mission to kill Stevie. A grieving Cash urged him to believe that Stevie had indeed lost her life, but the villain insisted on staying at the house until there was official confirmation. Fortunately, Cash managed to overpower Sidney when the gunman became distracted by Eden Fowler turning up at the house. Eden called police to the scene and Sidney was arrested for murder, sickeningly celebrating his victory as it dawned on him that Cash had been telling the truth about Stevie's fate. As the dust settled following a traumatic 24 hours in the bay, there were various repercussions from Stevie's death. Stevie's boyfriend Remy Carter bitterly blamed Cash for what had happened, claiming that he'd failed in his duty as her bodyguard. Turned out that a mistrial had led to Sydney being freed in the first place, which came about after someone involved had liked a social media post and derailed the case. Sadly, news of Sydney's release hadn't reached Cash until it was too late to protect Stevie. Cash was ultimately called to the city for a meeting with the security company who'd assigned him to Stevie's case three months ago. Will they agree with Remy that Cash is to blame, or will Cash's name be cleared? 